Us is all I'm lost. Get it so good. How are you doing welcome back to another youtube video um <laughs> whitney's asking if i've cooked lunch <laughs> no my darling i haven't cooked lunch anyways hey guys welcome back to another youtube video um yo let me sit down because i'm exhausted i've been busy the whole morning with a couple of things it's the 25th of um december which means it's christmas today so happy christmas to everyone celebrating christmas i hope you guys are having a wonderful time i'm out of breath let me sit down i don't know i think it's okay well i think it's fine i mean i wanted to put on my revlon um what's this ultra hd matte lip mousse but normally i don't like having lip color on i just like using my essence lip gloss and yeah i'm just ready to go when i have that on um otherwise it's christmas day today uh <laughs> yeah the messages are flooding in obviously um but i hope you guys are good i hope you guys are enjoying your christmas wherever you are with your families if you're alone like myself for now um merry christmas to you i am having <clears throat> i am having a friend over actually she was supposed to come in the morning like she texted me yesterday she's like i'm gonna i baked i'm gonna bring you like cake and muffins um this morning and i knew it wasn't going to be this morning because i know whitney like she's african time that girl like she she's she hasn't let go of that concept of african time um so i did take the morning to just like um sort out my my boxes that i'm planning to unbox today um i'll tell you more about that in a bit um and i also call my parents just to say hi and I spent a good portion of the morning also explaining to my dad what a power bottom is. <laughs> uh, crazy. So, yeah, we were talking about TD Jakes for a bit. Um, what else did I do? I showered. I had cereal. I don't want to have anything heavy. Um, because after Whitney comes, we are heading over to a friend's place also for lunch. Late lunch. Something like that. Oh. So, um, well. We have been invited over also for Christmas lunch. So there's that as well. Um, but otherwise, I just like felt like it was a good day to pick up my camera and record because I, I realized that I haven't recorded for you guys in a very, very long time. <laughs> like, and I'm not even going to come back on this video to be saying from now on, I'm going to be consistent. Nope. I don't think I'm going to commit myself to that in, anymore. Um, if I ever have, I can't even recall. But what I will promise you guys to do is not allow so much time in between the videos. I do have a reason for um, not recording on a long time, which I will also reveal in this video if you continue to watch. Um, but before I continue, like um, to all my Zamis, hey Zamis, thank you for sticking by. If you're not part of the family yet, please do consider to subscribe to be part of the family. Do like this video, share it. Um, yeah, I'm sure the algorithm would treat me nicely um, with this first video coming back. But anyways, um, do consider to be part of the family by subscribing, also sharing this video and liking this particular video and commenting if you want to comment. Um, otherwise, yeah, let's get right into it. Oh, yeah, I don't know. Like, I honestly don't know where to start. Um... <laughs> <laughs> your sadna when i tell you that i don't i mean i don't know honestly i don't know where to start with this video um but i did want to make it a light video because it is christmas i don't know when i'm going to edit and put it out 
but i just wanted to come back not too heavy with the story times um so i do have i mean this video mostly is just supposed to be like me unboxing um all the things that i got um during what's this again during black friday i like i had a lot of packages being delivered every other week so i just told myself i'm going to keep them not unbox them just wait until um christmas um to unbox them so i at least have something to unbox from christmas um so yeah this video is mainly just like about unboxing but of course i do have to explain like where i've been i do have to like catch it up a bit but i think videos that detail all those things will be subsequent videos i'll record obviously like i'll do a live update a proper one um and then other videos also uh but yeah just like to get you guys and like to fill you guys in just slightly um if you have me on my tiktok i'm sure you do know already um if you don't you're about to find out uh i'm sure if you also have like a good eye you will see already <laughs> or you will predict on what i'm about to tell you guys um but yeah i am with child <laughs> i am with child i am a couple of months along um i found out i found out do you know what i found out actually i found out if you watch my last video that video was uploaded uh, i might get the dates wrong but like if not on my actual birthday the day after so maybe the first of july i found out i was with child like on like the third of july so not too long after the last videos that i dropped which explains why i've been away for so long like these past couple of months have been hectic to begin with um but i'm slowly getting to the ease of things um so yeah i'll do a separate video for that i'll do a separate story time for that also um i won't really tell you much i'll just tell you probably how i found out um, the things I had to do, like, after finding out, because obviously I am in a new space now also. This is a new apartment, why I had to move out and all of those things. So if you do want to find out about all of those things, please do subscribe, stay tuned. There are lots of story times coming up. Um, but, like, what I'm bummed about or what I'm just, like, feeling mad about is the fact that this phone has also just frustrated me in the past couple of months with like when it comes to content creating and shooting stuff because it's only like 64 gigs i bought this phone like in 2019 so it's a pretty old phone back in 2019 64 gigs was okay for me um and now that i've picked up youtube like it's not enough like i'll record a video and i get frustrated when it's time to edit because when i'm trying to save it'll tell me that there's not enough space and don't tell me about buying free space i've bought free space already that thing doesn't work um so i don't know it's either i get a new phone um or <laughs> i buy a new camera again and this is also funny because i saw my camera just before i came here um thinking that my phone was going to be enough to um shoot my content but uh I probably didn't think that, think that through. So if I don't buy a new phone, I probably will buy like a, a new camera in time. So I'll decide between the two. But anyways, before I continue also with um, just like with the headlines, highlights. Um, so the first one is I am with child. That's why I've been away for so long, guys. I'm so sorry. But I guess now that you know the reason why, um, you'll forgive me. Um so yeah uh what else do i need to tell you just like briefly without you know delving too much into it i am in a new apartment that's also something new um yeah so everything else i guess you just hear in um the videos that will follow for now because i want this to be a very light video um i will be doing an unboxing and also the reason why I wanted to tell you guys that I am with child is because most of the things that I'll be unboxing guys are not mine. So this is not even like a, I mean, it's exciting because, you know, I haven't seen the stuff that I've bought. Most of them I bought online. Um, 
but the fact that i know what those things are already and the fact that a majority of them are not mine is not as exciting um which is why i also wanted to get myself something for christmas but i was like mm, let me hold off a bit um i'll probably get it like i don't know in a couple of weeks i felt like it was such an impulsive purchase or it was going to be an impulsive purchase so i was just like hold on just for a bit longer like you'll get it in a couple of weeks anyways without wasting any more of your time let's get straight into the unboxing let me just quickly show you guys the boxes that i'll be unboxing um before i start so these are the things that i plan to unbox today maybe i should start with a couple of the smaller ones first then i will um open this one because i know what this is already and it's taking up a whole lot of space uh, but yeah it's also possible that i might have to uh, yeah i was saying it is possible that i have to change stuff around um in the apartment because uh yeah you'll just see like the things i've got require me to reshuffle and rearrange the space so what i'll do is i'll start with those two guys also if you haven't noticed yeah i did like a mtiambi so all the <laughs> french mini um just so like you know my hands look cute while i'm unboxing anyways i'll start with these smaller ones now so what we will do is i'll grab my i can't even call it a craft knife like um if you work at amazon uh this knife that we use to open boxes so i'm going to use that i'm going to tilt the camera a bit because i'm going to use this space over here to unbox the things yeah um so let me grab a couple of boxes quickly no, i don't think that angle works i'll just have to be lifting up the boxes every time i'm unboxing because you guys won't see my face when i'm unboxing and i've positioned the camera down at the bottom i also just like My dad, like, he's so touched with this TDJ thing, shame, like. But anyways, so we'll start with the first box. Also, another disclaimer, guys, these, these, these packages, nothing in this, <laughs> nothing in this, um, in these packages, um, is anything glamorous or anything like that. So don't expect me to, like, unbox, like, I don't know, like, I told you, most of these things are for my baby. Um, so the first thing, J. is aquaphor so nothing exciting to you maybe but this is exciting for me because obviously i've been watching a whole lot of tiktoks and they recommend a whole lot of things obviously i've bought a couple of toiletries from like the local dms like in well yeah in person and they didn't have like things like aquaphor so i just went on amazon to get aquaphor um to add on to the toiletries that i've bought for my for my stranger <laughs> for my stranger yeah i'm thinking this unboxing will go by really quickly because um the boxes look like it's a lot of stuff that i got but it's actually not um the next thing that i got was ah yes okay i got a um, fabric shaver like a lint remover thing like because i noticed that my clothes i don't know if it's because i use a washing machine a lot um instead of hand washing clothes like back at home they gather lint stuff a lot and it's mostly on like my jersey so it's like on my jerseys on the bed sheets and i'm guessing it's because it's low quality bed sheets from here that i got no actually the bed sheets i got were from were from back home so anyways i got this phillips um fabric shaver i hope it works I hope it does what it's supposed to do. Next package. Okay, let me... You know, there are packages... There's actually two packages that I had to open. There's... I bought blinds as well. And I had to open that package because I couldn't continue, like, um, staying without installing them. So, so um, I got help with installing the blinds. So, I opened the blinds. I also opened this package here. And the reason why I opened this is because this is a personalized... I have to hide this because it has my baby's name. This is like a personalized pacifier holder. Like you clip it onto um, the baby's clothes. And then at the on the other end, you like um, hook it to the pacifier. And it's personalized. The reason why I opened that up was because I wanted to see 
if they had gotten or spelled the name correctly and they have so i'm really happy with this purchase I, i'm really happy with this purchase like this is the best purchase out of all the things that i've got this personalized pacifier um clip thing um i love it so much and i got that before so it also comes with the silicone pacifier i do have i have both like normal pacifiers um, I forgot the brand name. My mom did want to get like pacifiers from Tommy Tippy as well because the bottles that she got are from Tommy Tippy. I did send money over to her as well to buy stuff back at home because things are in my head. Things would have um, were cheaper. Um, but when I actually compare, not not as much. So I did send money over to her as well so she could buy a couple of things um that she'd bring along with her so like clothes some clothes actually a majority of the clothes like she bought and like she's bought like um bottles and other things and toiletries as well so and she really helped me out because initially i was very anxious with buying baby stuff like i don't know like i was just getting a lot of anxiety like with the initial purchase like the starting like in my mind i was like where do i even start like what do i even start with because i was just so confused so like I, I had like a list also but that didn't help because i was just like i don't know of any baby shops where i stay here in magdeburg like and buying in person is not the same as buying online i really don't like buying online unless it's like stuff like whatever a lint remover or, or anything like that but baby clothes and all of those things i like to touch feel feel the fabric um and all of that stuff so i was really overwhelmed with buying stuff and when she started buying i then got the courage to make the first purchase which was the baby stroller and then from you know the baby stroller became easy i started buying the baby bed and then after that as well that's when i just was like let me just clear the other things on the list um that i had um and then buying just became easier. So I've bought like a majority of the things that I want. Um, but obviously as a new mom, I don't know everything. Like I'll watch a TikTok and I'll be like, oh, okay. I think I need that as well. And yeah, so I buy as I go. The next purchase or the next box is... Okay, this is mine. Some of these things are mine. Um, should have opened this a long time ago. Oh no. No, please don't tell me. Please, like, hmm. I went and I bought, um, yo, okay, but I'll keep it anyways. But I'm so annoyed because, yo, I went and I got, um, this vitamin C. And, um, I also got myself, like, um, a screen protector for my phone but i'm annoyed because i got this and i forgot about it um and then i went also to dm which is like similar to a clicks here and i bought vitamin c again a serum um so i'll just keep this for whenever but like i never buy too much of toiletries um i just buy as and when they finish because sometimes like a serum will last me like two months um, but that's fine. I don't know if I should be careful with some of these. Some of the items I feel like I might have to return. I don't know why. I just have a feeling, especially with... I got a carpet for the floor, ne? So my baby can crawl around. But I have a feeling that it's not the carpet or the type of carpet that I want. So I'm trying to be careful also with how I open the packages. So that just in case I need to return... I'm able to still see what's written on the package. For instance, this, I feel like I want to return. Because why is it so small? You know these, um, you know these, um, it's not even the color that I wanted, to be honest. You know these um, crib barrier things that you put around the crib? Um, this is one of them. It was supposed to be slightly bigger than this. Um, it's not the color that I wanted, not the size that I wanted. And I got this from, I got this from, mm, I got this from, hey bo, where you buy hair? AliExpress. I got this from AliExpress. Um, it was the only place where I thought it was cheap. 
and I don't like the size, don't like the color. It's not the color. Anyways, our next package is from Temu. Um, these packages from Temu were my first ever purchases from Temu. Um, because I don't know, I've just, I mean, like when I when I see the stuff on the on the app. They seem relatively cheap, but I don't know. I don't trust. I've always just been an Amazon girl. Girl, this package is full, full of stuff. So let's see. The first thing I got, ah, guys, I'm afraid if I show you these things, then you'll guess the. Then you'll know the gender of my baby. Ah. Okay. Anyways, but like. Um, I mean, you've already seen the packaging. Anyways, there's a story that will come up. Um, a story time of how my mom ruined my gender reveal for me. So anyways, it's fine. You guys, all you get to know now is the gender of the baby, which is a boy. I got this baby care kit stuff with like a brush, um, a comb, a thermometer thing, a clipper, a nasal whatever it is and um a tweezer also i guess to take out boogers from the nose scissors a filer and i'm not sure what that last thing is for so i guess now you know the gender of my baby i also got a white noise machine i don't know if i'm not sure if this will work but it's portable which is also great because I could also have it attached to the pram somewhere. Also got like this baby vision um, trigger cards. So these are like these um, black and white and red cards for babies to help them with um, their vision. So during tummy time, time, you just like lay them across whether it's like the, the cot or anywhere where you're making your baby lie down for tummy time. And um, huh. Okay, three to six months. I bought I bought for three to six months. And I think I also got for zero to three months because the three to six have the red, but the zero to three only has like the cards, the flashcards with like black and white. Um, because babies don't see color, I think they say until they're three months old. So I got them these for tummy time. Oh yeah, okay. So these are the ones for zero to three. These are the ones that are just black and white, ne? because they won't be able to see color. I've been doing a lot, hey. On top of like just um helping with their or stimulating their brain development now while they're still in my womb, I've been listening to classical music. I actually ordered like also like a bedtime story book, which still hasn't been delivered. I ordered it like sometime in mid November, and my plan for that was to be reading um um stories to him now while he's still in my belly. So he could firstly recognize my voice. Secondly, just like, I don't know, <laughs> make him smarter. Um, Let me stop for a bit and go pop my my pizza into the oven because I haven't ordered in like I said I would because I'm recording on my phone, obviously. And also, I don't know how long it would take. Normally, like an order takes like 40 minutes. I don't know when Whitney's arriving. So let me just go, go pop in my pizza in the oven and I'll, and I'll be back. So it was pointers. I'm back, guys. I just need to not forget that I've put in something in the oven. Very it was pointers for me to hide the gender from you guys because you're going to be able to see. This is also something that I got for the um, baby bed. Oh. Okay, I also got like um medicine dispenser thing for my for my baba. Um so it comes in like a, so instead of just like giving the medicine with um normal measuring spoon that you get with medication, like it comes with a syringe that you measure with and then it's attached to like a pacifier thing. So they'll take the medicine through the pacifier. I thought that was like nice to get. Um, I got sheets as well for, for the baby bed. I got these little um, container things that you hook onto. So what I did buy as well is like um, a rolling cart where you put like your diapers, um, your other things, your 
clothing at the bottom so it's like for me it's like three layers and it's like a trolley cot that you use maybe when you're changing the baby at night so instead of getting up from your bed and getting you know a change of clothes or an extra diaper from the wardrobe you have this um rolling cart next to your bed next to the crib and these are some of the attachments that i've bought for the cart so in here they'll probably have like i don't know i don't know guys i'm a new mom what do you put like your ah uh, maybe the creams the lotions in here like the the thermometer stuff and in here something else i'll figure it out guys Yo, uh -uh. and then this is also like for the trolley cart rolling cart thing um to help <sighs> to help separate and section the things like in here in one of them i'll probably put like rompers in this one i'll probably put like receivers or something and this last one i'll put like i don't know like the diapers whatever guys you get the trick so let me open a, a big box this time around. I got uh, an Angel Care classical extra large diaper bin. So most moms, well, some moms, not most actually, they say diaper bins are like useless to get because you can just throw away the diapers like in the trash. Like, and it's true because I have like my trash facility thing outside right outside my apartment but i also think this is really nice to have um because i take out my trash like once a week um and i really wanted a tommy tippy um diaper bin because with the tommy tippy one like when you insert the diaper it twists so it locks the smart as well um but what i realized with the tommy tippy diaper bag is that the refills which is the plastics that go inside are very very expensive they cost like what 20 i think almost 25 euros per refill and i was just like i'm not spending that amount of money on refills this one refills for angel care are like yo, i might get the figure wrong but like maybe like 10 euros or something which is far less expensive than the Tommy Tippy one. So, and as much as I want the best for my babe, I am still very much um, economical and very frugal. Get sad now because you know we are still like not working yet. I'm a student, mom. Okay, okay let's open this big box. Let's try open that. Yo, I'm starving now, hey? I had cereal in the morning because I was feeling cute, yeah? And that was before I... That was before I showered and did my hair, my face and all of that stuff. But now I'm feeling hungry. okay i got um you can see the picture i got a i didn't get a typical belego guys like it's a baby wrap so these days there's a stylish way that moms wrap or carry their babies it's normally in the front with the baby wrap thing which is made out of cloth as opposed to the old-fashioned belego so i got that as well Okay, I'm tired of unboxing. I don't know. I'm so tired. Ah, this is nice. You know this crab toy? <laughs> I got my baby this crab toy. I didn't want to get my baby that cactus thing that makes babies cry. I got them this also is for tummy time it's that crab thing that goes from one side to another so your baby you know gets um used to moving their head from side to side i thought this was really a cool thing to get for them um 
mm, I'm not gonna open it, open it. But yeah, I have forgotten about that. I also got my booba some mittens because my mom couldn't find mittens. Um, this is a pack of two for 12. It's a pack of 12, I think. 12 mittens for newborns. I also, okay, here's the, here's the trolley thing that I was talking about. I'm annoyed at the picture because it looks short. If it's short, I'm going to scream. got another pacifier clip thing um i'm sure i got it because it was cheap um so you also clip it on there and then yeah i'm not going to unbox this i know what it is um it's my shoe rack nothing interesting there um yeah, it's my shoe rack, definitely. And then, you guys are almost there, hey? So let me pause a bit and go check out my pizza. I'm starving. So what I think I'll do is I'll unbox the rest of the stuff off camera. I'll unbox the rest of the stuff off camera and then I'll just show them to you guys and talk them talk you guys through them. But how uh, it's only so much I can do here. Yeah, looks like this party that I'm going to. It's gonna start. So I must do. I wonder what kind I was cooking. Honestly, it's gonna start in the late afternoon and end at night. It's also like um, we'll be playing games and all of that stuff. So it'll be fun. So yeah, for now, guys, mm -mm. I'll unbox. And then I'll show you guys when things here. And then maybe I'll end off the video. And then you guys will just have to stay tuned for other videos that will follow. Hopefully more fun story times. Mm -hmm. mm, maybe also showing you my new apartment. Maybe. I don't know, I'll see. Hmm. Merry Christmas.
so another thing that i won't bother unboxing is this this is um a baby what do they call it those rocking machines yeah for when i don't want to carry them i got one of those um your son i won't even assemble it i can assemble that i also want to assemble this i want to assemble that i don't have the energy um so yeah i think that's it for now for this video that's all the energy i have for today <laughs> that's all the energy i have for today so um yeah i guess i'll see you guys on the next one but before you go please obviously don't forget to like comment and subscribe and don't forget to turn on that notification bell so that you are notified every time i drop a video so yeah i guess i'll see you guys on the next one bye zamis yes whitney's baked me some muffins guys and they look so homely they look so homely yeah i'm almost done yeah